Okay, so this is my new um, vacuum coffee maker. And I just got this for my birthday. And I also got some lovely coffee from Monmouth Street Coffee. So I've got some uh, Finca uh, Maracara from El Salvador and some Kiandu from Kenya. Today we're going to have the coffee from El Salvador. So this is the coffee making apparatus, the vacuum coffee apparatus. And, um, basically I have my little doodad with methylated spirits in there, that'll be our heat. We've already boiled some water and now I, I just, basically what you do is you put the water in here, flows up into there and then the vacuum sucks it back down and put some coffee in here and it sucks it back down to the coffee. So here's the um, coffee filter, uh, reusable coffee filter, very environmentally sound right down here, and that just pops in there. And then now I've got to tighten the, pull a little tension, there's a spring right in there, and pull the tension that, that holds the filter in place. So we get as few grounds in, their cof in our coffee. So uh, first of all, I need to take and fill the water up to an acceptable level. I don't think I'm gonna have quite five cups of coffee today. That would be a little bit ambitious, seeing as Sue, my lovely assistant, does not drink the evil brown beverage. She's much more of a cup of brown joy girl herself. So let's just call that good. So that should be good for uh, three cups of coffee. I think that'll put me on the ceiling sufficiently. So then now we take the filter G jar and put that in there. Carefully making sure that we doesn't we don't uh, burn one's hand on the now sufficiently hot bottom flask. Next, we take the uh, take and light the uh, methylated burner. Ah, oh, there it is. So this is. Oops. I think a long match would be easier to sweep. Oh, there we go. I think I might have been a little ambitious with the whole <coughs> methylated spirits wick, but hopefully it will reduce itself there. So now we put that underneath there, looking sufficiently beaker-esque. Wow, this is... Yeah. What's that? Don't forget to put the coffee in. Ah, uh, the... Co well, no, no, you put the coffee in, there's no water in there. Um, but yeah, put some coffee in. So I'm now supposed to take one um, thing of a coffee. One thing I'm curious about is this is kind of for um, espresso, so we'll see how. Oh, look at that. So the coffee is now in the coffee thing. And the... Um, <laughs> this is working quite effectively. And now it's already, you can see the coffee being forced up by the pressure. So it works very much similar on, as the, the whole stovetop process. Um, but uh, instead of it being pushed up through the grounds, the water is pushed up through the grounds this way. And so now I'm supposed to take the lovely bamboo mixer here. And do this. Stir the coffee. Now it looks like the we've got most of the coffee we've got most of the water boiled off. So now I'm supposed to remove the heat and uh, oops, I'm supposed to take that off and uh, maybe I do this there. Extinguish that. Now I mix the coffee in so that the grounds and the coffee have time to relax. And then, as you look down to the thing. As the water cools, the steam pressure from the steam pulls the water back down. This is actually a much more efficient process than I was anticipating. This makes it in really crazy amounts of time. I mean, it's already done. And that's it. And there we are. 
Ta-da! So now we take this uh, top bit off and gently, oh, I can see why, oops, that's one. I can see why they said not to put that down too hard, heavily. I would use the, uh, that. Okay. See now why they told you not to put it in too snugly. Because it gets pulled down rather sufficiently by its own pressure. And then it has its own little stand that you put it in. And so that just sits over there. And there's my coffee. I will have to um, play around with this to see how it uh, tastes. And then all of you do is take said coffee, and now this becomes a rather cool pouring device. And then now we pour the coffee into the mug. I'm gonna have to play with this because this is a little bit weaker than I normally have my coffee. But um, it all went so quickly. <laughs> wow, that's pretty impressive.